expect whoever goes in there, you're expected to make the play. Uh, that's why we play so many guys, because Coach Meyer, Coach Smith, and the offense have enough confidence in those many guys that go in to make the play. So when we go in there, we just want to do the best we can, uh, make the play if our number is called, because we may not know how many shots we're going to get. But uh, we have confidence in each other as a unit, and JT has confidence in any other receivers that he's going to throw the ball to. JT said some... Some, made some history today here. As you've grown to know him the past couple of years, what is it that you see in him that makes him unique? Uh, his leadership. When JT talks, everybody listens. His command of the huddle. Um, you know, he didn't like our demeanor before the game, but he came He came at us, and I feel like that's what got us off to a pretty good start. So when he challenges us, we listen, and the confidence that he brings out in the way he plays each and every down, we have no choice but to match that. So pass that. What? What? what, what when you see something he doesn't like, what what did he do today, for example, to try to correct it? Uh, he's going to challenge us, challenge everybody on offense, receivers, O line, um, running backs, everybody. Uh, we have a standard here at Ohio State, and if we're not meeting up to it, his job as a leader is to check that and to make sure we're um, meeting that expectation. So uh, he does a great job as a leader. Um, we know what to expect from him each and every day because he's going to give us his all. Terry, pass that. What kind of passer is he? Obviously, he just set the school record for pa touchdown passes. I mean, what stands out about him as a guy who throws the ball? Um, it's almost like he knows the defense before they even get into their coverage. And he's making checks all the time. Um, he gives us confidence as a receiver that if we're on our spot, he's going to get us the ball. So knowing that he knows the, the defense and our offense uh, inside and out, um, we have confidence in him as a uh, as a quarterback, and we know as a receiver, we just got to make the play for him. So were you channeling Noah Brown there on your touchdown catch? I mean, uh, and what did it mean to you to get a touchdown? Um, you know, it's something I really pray a lot about. I work really hard for this. Um, I just got to thank my teammates and my unit. Um, they push me every day just to go out there and make that play. Um, I've just been waiting for one opportunity to come out there and show what I could do. So I mean, I, everybody was so happy for me on the sideline. I just, and I'm just happy to be a part of all this. The fervor with which you went up for that ball, and some guys are going for balls, is that indicative of the competition in your room? I mean, how would you describe what, what's going on in your room right now for guys trying to get the play in time? Um, well, you saw even being out there in Austin, so that just shows you how much depth we have and how much competition there is. But when you go in there, you don't know you know how many passes you're going to get, so you got to make that play. We have confidence in whenever, whoever goes in there, they're going to go out, up there and make that play. So I feel like that's why JT just puts the ball where we can make a play, and it's our job to come down with it. Terry, you've been a name that we've heard a lot about.